Hi everyone, my name is Hannah. I'm a community manager of Morpheus Labs. Well, I'm not sure if you guys have heard of us before, but if you haven't, you've definitely come to the right place because I'm about to tell you about a whole new world of blockchain. So who are we and what is it that we're trying to do? Well, our objective is to build an enterprise grade blockchain platform as a service. And we call this BPASS with an additional blockchain app marketplace that enables organizations of any size, regardless of whether they are a two-person company or a mega-sized one to rapidly design, deploy, and operate distributed ledgers. So, well, does this sound complex? Not to worry, it is actually a very simple concept. So, basically, our platform provides a blockchain innovation lab and hence the name Morpheus Labs. We provide the necessary infrastructure and the right tools and allow people to test drive their ideas at little cost and time. I mean, this is exceptional because think about it, blockchain technology will actually help to simplify a lot of processes, enables multiple parties to write to a single ledger, and best of it all, it is immutable. Many companies out there do want to adopt blockchain solutions for these reasons, but it's very costly and just very difficult to get started. Each organization or each company has their own needs and wants. They are all different in their own ways and each of them will have their own way to be efficient. That's the thing about us. We're not giving a one-size-fits-all sort of solution, but a customized one. So. Here in our white paper, you can see some screenshots there you go, of our platform. Well, it shows how carefully the platform has been designed and it certainly looks very easy to use. But if you're not happy with just the screenshots, we also have a very recent video on the demo of the platform to show you how it really runs. And I could provide a link to that under this video as well, so you can have a look. Well. As per our, where is it, um, technical roadmap, development team is working very hard on the platform and our own app store too, too, sorry. We're yet to disclose our GitHub source code yet, by the way. I know a lot of people have been asking about this. So our GitHub um, for public information will only be marginal and is only for facilitating user interaction with the platform, like such as plugins for IDEs or snippets, language server modules, and simple things like that. And that's what we're perfecting now for the public. We also do have GitHub where we store our platform core software, but it's not going to be open to the public. Reason being, our aim is to be the best in class infrastructure provider for blockchain development. And there are many applications, tools, and technologies coupled in such way that we want to protect for, to the public. And trust me when I say this, we aim to be as transparent as possible and as open as possible. And I understand that the transparency typically comes with the GitHub link. But we're really building an enterprise platform and some of the source codes are proprietary. And if we expose these source codes, our competitor might just get an unfair advantage over us. If you really do want to take a look at where we are, please engage us by reaching out to one of the admins and we will help you. We want you to know, please, that we are on the right track. In terms of business development, Currently, we have received proposals to set up subsidiary and prisons in China, Japan, Malaysia, and Dubai. For Japan and Malaysia, we are in the midst of setting up our R&D and additional technical team. For China, we all know that it's a big market and such we're taking a more strategic approach where resources could be intensive. I'll tell you more about this later. Finally, for Dubai, we are still in negotiation with an interested party. Further to this, 
We're also in Project Scoping Stage with ProLine, Integrated Intelligence, its Smart Nation and Airport related. And why three technologies on supply chain? Oh wait, before before I go any further, it reminds me that one of the most frequently asked questions I get is how are we then different from Stratis? Well, mainly Stratis has its own blockchain. But our blockchain platform service is not tied to any single blockchain. We allow enterprises and developers to explore different blockchains for their products in our BPAS. All right. So now on to our tokens. How can we use them? Where can we use them? Its primary use will be to pay for services that Morpheus Labs provide. Paying for platform subscription application usage and distributorship license. Also, tokens are to be traded on cryptocurrency exchanges. Tokens will also be used as a form of payment to incentivize developers to contribute good code to the App Store and what we call proof of reputation. And when we talk about exchanges, the all-time favorite questions all investors just love asking is, when are you going to list and how much is it going to be at? Please, we understand that liquidity is important and we are currently working with two exchanges. However, listing on exchanges comes with requirements and we are working very hard to clear these as well. Once we sign in with them, we will announce and please wait for our announcement. All right. Next up, token generation event structure. As you can see, the total supply is 1 billion, and out of that, 250 million MITX are to be issued in this event. The price will be 8,000 of them for one Ethereum. Uh, we're currently in early bird sale period with 35% bonus. It will end, however, on the 9th of March. After that, it's followed by pre-sales, which will start on the 10th of March and runs until 23rd of March. The pre-sales will come with 20% bonus. Once the cap of um, 25 million US dollars is reached, the public sale will close regardless of which phase the sale is in. Our token will be listed in exchange upon the end of the token event, if regardless of the amount raised. All tokens will be unlocked on the 15th of April, and this includes the bonuses. But the team's token will be unlocked gradually throughout the period of one year. Looking at the token distribution, a lot of people ask me what the 30% community reserve fund is. Well, our main business model is B2B, which means business to business. And as an infrastructure hub, we will need to build a strong community, not only with retail users, but also business partners such as distributorship, strategic alliance, joint ventures, listing on major exchanges, establish a strong presence in greater China region, marketing and events, bounty and more. So those activities will make up for that 30% community reserve. All right. Right now, onto our team. So, Peihan and Branson, as you can see, these two are the two co founders of Morpheus Labs. Well, I honestly think they were quite special in the sense that I've not seen an ICO whose founders are as active as we are on the main Telegram chat. I mean, I'm sure you've heard of those that conduct an AMA Ask Me Anything session once or twice throughout the entire ICO period. But because they're so active on the Telegram chat, we're like technically having an AMA constantly every day. Um, next page, Dorel and Bruce, they're our very talented development team. So those people who have some intensive tech related questions, not me, but I can link you up with these two and clarify them yourself. We aim to be as transparent as we can be. Now, um, I, they're, they're the team members. <laughs> uh, there you go. You can see me. Um, well, I really don't know if it's like for um, 
other ICOs as well. But for us, we have a very strong and active internal team chat room. And what's really surprising to me is that even our advisors are actively discussing their views and opinions with us on a daily basis. They're really enthusiastic about the project, and I can't be more grateful to hear their insights every day. So, well, this is it. This is the brief or not so brief um, overview of Morpheus Labs, and I hope I helped a little bit. Um, just two additional things. To those people who are not aware, the famous ICO Closed and Fun um, TAAS test, they have contributed to us quite a significant amount. And we've also recently signed an MOU with Momentum Works whose main backer is one of the big three in China. So I'm sure you know what this means. If you have any more questions, please come to our Telegram chat room and I will be there. Well, thank you for listening to me. Bye-bye.